So, we really have to submit this form. Otherwise, i-hold ni AdSense yung ating mga income from YT. Hello guys! Welcome back to my channel. This is A.R. Legaspi. And muli tayo ay nagbabalik sa mga tutorial about YouTube updates or anything about YouTube. Uh, my apologies for being so busy and masyado tayong maraming kaganapan kaya hindi tayo nakapag-upload. And by the way, I'm back in the Philippines na. Nandito na ako sa Pilipinas and yeah. So, uh, I will try to give more time sa aking YouTube channel. And thank you for staying sa aking channel and sa patuloy na panunood ng aking mga video tutorials. So, Yun nga guys, last September 17, I received this email informing me that my U.S. tax form expires at the end of 2024. And it says nga na it's time to refresh your U.S. tax form. So, if ever daw hindi natin ma-update yung ating tax form, makakaroon tayo ng default tax rate of 24% of total earnings worldwide. Okay? So... I believe hindi lahat nakareceive ng gantong email but to make sure mag-log in kayo sa inyong Google AdSense account and doon meron din dong notification. And yun nga, sabi nga dito is every few years, creators need to, to resubmit their US tax forms in AdSense for YouTube to make sure their information is correct. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, hindi ko alam. Ngayon ko lang nalaman every year dapat pala nag, uh, nagsasubmit tayo ng US tax form. Kasi yung last na submission ko is nung na-monetize yung channel ko which was way back um, 20, 2020. Hindi ako nagkakamali. Uh, and yun lang yun. And after that, hindi na ako nagpa-file ng mga um, another tax form or whatsoever. So, yan, para hindi na tayo magtagal, guys, um, papakita ko sa inyo step by step yung pag, paano natin i-update yung ating US tax form. But, of course, uh, kung hindi ka pa nakasubscribe sa akin channel, please subscribe, like this video, and comment down kung meron kayong comment, kung meron kayong mga um, gustong itanong at hanggat kaya kong sagutin, sasagutin ko yan. Okay, so please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel, guys. So, without further ado, tala na sa akin. tutorial. And, nandito na nga tayo sa aking Google AdSense account, guys. And as you may see, meron dito naka-red na box na nagsasabi na ma-expire na yung aking tax form end of this year. And, Google may need to withhold up to 30% or hold payouts completely until we submit a new tax form and it's approved. So, we really have to submit this form. Otherwise, i-hold ni AdSense yung ating mga income from YT. Okay? Papakita ko sa inyo step by step kung paano tayo mag-fill out ng form. Okay, so let's start now. Let's click submit new form, guys. May tayo yung form sa payments info just in case na wala kayong red. So, meron din tayo palang kailang i-update yung Singapore tax ko. Since, actually, wala ako na-receive na, na email uh, about this one. That's why hindi ko alam. I'm not aware. Ganyan ko lang din alaman. So, I'm gonna make, uh, I'm going to make another video how to update the Singapore tax info. Okay, guys? But now, let's um, let's focus on the U.S. tax form. So, ayan. Nakita nyo, ayan yung ating old form where in claim natin lahat na na offer sa mga non-U.S. residents. So, yeah. Let's click submit new form. Start new form. May magpa-prompt na ganitong message. Verification lang yan. Let's just click start. And then, magpa-pop up na magpa-verify kung ikaw nga. So, I'm gonna pause for now. Hold on. And, ayun. Um, balik tayo. So, ito. Uh, what type of account is... Yeah, just click lang natin individual. Then, next. Are you a citizen of, uh, res or resident of the United States? No. So, let's do next. And then, dito, ang pipiliin natin, guys, is yung W8 Ben. Kasi ito yung commonly used by non-US individuals. So, hindi naman tayo taga-US, hindi naman tayo citizen ng US. So, ito yung form na ating isasubmit. So, let's start. So, ayan, tax identity. Fill in lang natin kung ano yung pangalan ng owner ng tuto ng channel. DDA, doing business as name. Okay? And country or region of citizenship. So, tayo nakatira. 
of course, Philippines. So, hanapin lang natin yung Philippines. And then, tax identification number. Kung may PIN ka, um, pwede mong ilagay dyan. Pwede natin ilagay. Uh, pwede rin namang optional kung walang PIN. Okay. Next, let's click next. And then, street address. Uh, Nafill in lang natin yung current address natin. So, I will fill in. So, yun guys, na-fill in ko na. So, dito sa mailing address, um, dito sa, sa box na to, tick mo lang to kung pareho yung mailing address mo at saka yung permanent address. Okay? So, let's click next after filling out the address. And then, are you claiming a reduced rate of withholding under a tax treaty? Uh, yes, I am eligible for a reduced withholding rate. Natin to. Resident of the following Philippines. Alright, so special rates, other cap, yan, lahat, itik yung natin yan lahat. Click, it is article, article 13, withholding tax rate, 15%. Um, yan, click natin, ito din, article 8, withholding 0%. And then, click natin to, to then, and then article 13, 15%. Okay, ayan. So, click lang natin to. Ah, okay. Kailangan natin mag-add ng foreign team. <laughs> Tax identity. Pause ko lang, guys. Mag-fill in ako. Ayan, nilagay ko na. Nawala na yung um, notification. Uh, so, click lang natin next. So, yun na, no? 0%, 15%. Ayan. Next. Ayan. Has uh, provided within US? Of course, no. I certify. Click natin yan. Next. Go paperless. Click lang natin yung paperless para hindi na sila kailangan mag, mag, magpadala ng sulat via mail. So, lahat ng, lahat ng notification will be delivered to, to us via email. Okay. Then, Next. Ayan. So, I confirm. Confirm lang natin. And then, next. Under penalties, I declare. Blah, blah, blah. Click lang natin to. And then, I certify. Ayan. I, I acknowledge. Yes, I am the beneficial owner named in the tax identification. And, so, let's just start. So, So, I think okay na. Na-approve na tayo. Agad-agad. Ayan. 2023. So, yung 2024, hindi pa siya covered kasi hindi pa naman tapos yung 2024. So, that's it, guys. Ganun lang kadali. O, oh, diba? Um, so, yun. Bagawa ako ng bagong... Uh, panibagong videos about the Singapore tax information. And, yun na nga guys. Maraming salamat. And, I'm hoping na may natutunan kayo sa aking vlog for today. Thank you so much. And, um, hopefully, mag-subscribe kung hindi pa ka pa man nakapag-subscribe sa aking channel. And, see you on my next vlog. Magandang buhay sa ating lahat. Goodbye!